Good morning, good morning. Got something simple for you this morning. Uh, big tech, and not, not just tech, but all kinds of industry have, have gotten lazy. And now it seems like they're taking advantage of the people that are, are brand loyal. So let me unwrap this. It won't take long. Uh, let's use drones as an example because that's, you know, what kind of prom prompted me to make this video. But it's definitely not the only product. So DJI. I love DJI. Um, but they've been doing what a lot of companies have been doing, especially in the tech industry. And that is, instead of really making a new product, they just keep re-releasing the same products with different features, right? Uh, how many different uh, Samsung S20s are there? That's what I've got. I've, I'm, I'm, yes, I'm old. Um, I've got an S20 here. This happens to be the S20 Plus, I believe. Um, there's, gosh, I don't know. I think four or five, if not more, S20s out there, right? And it's the same with all the others, right? The newer the newer models. You look at all the uh, iPhones out there. There's a billion different models of iPhone for the same same number, if you will, right? I don't know where they're at. I don't I don't keep keep up on this stuff anymore. I done quit that a long time ago, but so it's not the only thing, though. Drones, phones, I mean, you see it in, in technology a lot. But it's not just technology. There are many different companies that make many different types of products that because sales is down, now they're taking advantage of the brand loyal people because there are people out there that it doesn't matter what a company comes out with, they got to go out and run and buy it. Now, you'll find this a lot in the tech industry especially in drones phones stuff like that um even ecoflow there are people that uh, are over in the ecoflow groups and stuff they actually label themselves as ecoholics and uh every product that ecoflow comes out with oh they gotta buy it they gotta have it whether they need it or not whether they even really have a use for it or not they've got to buy it and it, it, they gotta have it and it doesn't even matter if it's a small iteration, a small change of something that they already produced. They got to have it. They got to have it. And yeah, I'm, I'm going to pull back to somebody here on the YouTubes too. Uh, they're independent with Refuge Medical, right? Um, constantly coming out with new kits and stuff like that. Folks, that's taking advantage of people. That's not, oh, we're providing a better service. That's salesman jargon. That's bullshit's what that is. They aren't worried about and focused on providing, you know, a multitude of kits for a multitude of case uses. And the, No, it's to go after the brand loyal people because there are absolute idiots out there that have to have every single eye fact that he produces. Why? Well, eh, idolatry, yo. I mean, and that's what all this boils down to is idolatry. The, the brand loyal people that have to buy every single product that a company manufactures, that's idolatry and it's materialism. Both of them are very, very heavily scoffed at by the father. So I would say that if, if you're a company that claims to be... um claims to be working in service of the father and you're feeding into the brand loyalty thing and the idolatry uh, idolatry thing whether it be on a product or on the person mm, man i would not like to be you when that day comes up that the father starts asking what your deeds were because it's easy to 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 remember and it's easy to point out the good deeds that we do uh, but not so much the ones that uh, maybe not so good. So anyway, don't you fall for it. Whether it be an IFAC, whether it be a drone, whether it be a cell phone, don't fall for it. Find what you need. Put together a list of what options, what features it is that you absolutely have to have. Pick out a product and be happy with it. Be content. I mean, that's what we're supposed to do anyway, right? We're not supposed to constantly be coveting the new thing. Oh, wait, that's another aspect of it. Wow, I better quit before I uh, 
start really pissing off the people that think they follow the Bible. Shalom.